another video of circuit digest the topic for today's project is cheap and easy fm radio receiver circuits on the internet does it really work so for a recent project of our we needed a fm receiver circuit and we wanted to try out some uh, simple and easy fm receiver circuit that we found on the internet but to our surprise that circuits are really just the theoretical representation of how a fm uh, demodulator circuit should work and the circuits doesn't actually work at all and it's definitely not recommended for a day to day application so which is why we uh, decided to build the circuit ourselves and show you how the circuit doesn't actually works and you should not waste your time and build the circuit yourself so as you can see uh, we have the circuit in front of uh, me right now so as you can see there are two circuits i built the circuit with two different version that i found on the internet this circuit over here this circuit over here as you can see is made with the bf494 transistor which is this schematic right here this uh this circuit somewhat works and uh, i'll show you by testing this circuit and this is uh this is another circuit that i have found on the internet this is based on the very popular 2n3904 general purpose transistors and this circuit doesn't work at all so i'll just uh, skip this circuit for this video so as you can see right now there is <coughs> this portion also this is the lm3086 based op amp amplifier circuit which is driving a small little speaker and the output from the uh, fm receiver circuit is uh, fit to this potentiometer over here and which is uh, driving the op amp and this uh, op amp is then driving this uh, small speaker so let me pause the video connect everything up and you will uh, hear what this small cheap little fm transmitter sound like so as you can see right now i have connected a big battery uh, with this circuit with the ht60 connector and i and the speaker was right over there and as you can see you, have, you can hear some random noise nothing more and if i turn this uh, variable capacitor to tune the circuit and uh, you could not hear anything so uh, when i built the circuit for the first time my initial assumption was there was some mistake in my circuit but uh, that is not the case the circuit is fine but in order to receive just a basic signal you have to have the receiver right uh, beside this circuit so for that reason we have uh, this uh, raspberry pi based fm transmitter circuit so we have made this raspberry pi we have configured this raspberry pi as an fm uh, transmitter and we will play some audio through this and uh, let's see if this uh, small circuit is able to pick it up or not so give me uh, just so, okay i'll pause the video and set the raspberry pi up so as you can see right now i have enabled the transmitter with uh, the raspberry pi right here over here as you can see and this uh, raspberry pi is transmitting a signal and now what i will as you can see after the receiver is ju just right beside the uh, transmitter you cannot hear a thing from the receiver circuit and for demonstrating that the raspberry pi is working i have used another phone of mine as you can see i have used another phone of mine to show you that the i have set another phone of mine to show you that the radio is actually working and what we'll do now is So now as you can see that I have tuned this radio to exact frequency which I have set in the uh, for the FM radio receiver which is 90 Hz over here as you can see may see you may or may not see this is the frequency which I have set right here and the audio is playing through the circuit but if i power up this circuit and tune it the 
the small circuit will not be able to play the song so i hope you learned something and if you are thinking about building the circuit don't waste your time because this kind of circuit is not practical for any day to day or real life applications thank you